Niner's angle on the bow now, zero. Down the boat? It's a bow shot. Car number 22, Fireball Roberts, begins to move. In 40 laps, Roberts has moved from 17th position to challenge the leaders. He roars past his pit in second place. A lead foot, a wise head, and a fast car. Hello, YouTube modeling community. This is Rick, and uh, the primary thing I want to do today is uh, do a first update on uh, my entry into the um, NASCAR group build uh, sponsored by uh, Jeff at Jeff's Model Garage and Fred Pappy at um, West Georgia Rod and Custom. So, um, Recall, I'm doing the uh, uh, ANT kit on the uh, Fireball Roberts 1957 Ford, um, number 22. Um, and we've got uh, the body almost done. I've got to do some more masking and a little more trimming uh, around the edges on this. But uh, um, it's, uh, it's coming along. And we've got the... Uh, chassis and the uh, interior uh, um, put together here and uh, we're going to, uh, we had the engine done uh, basically during the last uh, uh, video, but uh, uh, we've got it installed in there. So um, it's coming along and I just wanted to, uh, to give everybody uh, an update. Um, also, uh, wanted to do a quick introduction on uh, my build for the uh, 2023 uh, Cancer Awareness Group Build, uh, sponsored by Bob. I'm going to be doing this kit, the uh, 1955 Corvette uh, by AMT Ertl. Uh, this was an old kit I picked up at a show, I believe. Uh, I'm not sure of the time frame on it. But uh, I'll say more about uh, uh, who I'm building it for and uh, uh, how we're going to uh, uh, dedicate it. So, uh, uh, and I'll do uh, a little bit of a, a more detailed introduction uh, then. Uh, and the last little bit of information and news uh, is a uh, stash ad. And let me just take a minute to... Uh, uh, zoom out here a little bit, and uh, okay, uh, a uh, neighbor of mine, friend of mine, uh, who does uh, a lot of eBay trading, goes to auctions and buys and sells on uh, on eBay, uh, came back from an auction where he had uh, picked up four kits, uh, and he wanted if I uh, wanted them, and uh, he paid uh, $30 for four kits, uh, and I uh, gave him a 10% markup, so uh, got the kits for $33, so uh, four kits for 33 that's uh, seven-something a kit, uh, and I think we did pretty well. Uh, the first one is this uh, uh, Airfix uh, Douglas A26 Invader. Uh, 170 second scale uh, bomber and uh, I think that's going to be uh, uh, a fun little uh, build and continuing on I'm reaching here uh, put that aside the uh, Tamiya or Tamiya uh, Grumman F4F Wildcat, and that's a 148 scale. And we also got uh, another uh, Tammy kit, the Brewster Buffalo uh, F2A2, um, and also uh, 148 scale. 
So uh, from everything I've heard about uh, the Tamiya aircraft, um, I'm looking forward to uh, to doing both of those. And the final is another 172nd uh, of the uh, FM1 Wildcat. Uh, and this is a Hobby Boss kit. Uh, Hasegawa, uh, yeah, not, yeah, ha yeah, Hasegawa, not Hobby Boss. Hasegawa, Hobby Kits. Um, and as I understand it, the FM1 was the, the fixed wing, non-foldable wing version of the Wildcat. A uh, little, I think a little stronger engine and a little, little bigger uh, wingspan. But uh, so, uh, I haven't done a lot of airplanes. I'm looking forward to uh, to doing all these. So, uh, that's the update for uh, now. Uh, a minute here to thank everybody who subscribes and watches. And uh, if you're... Uh, not subscribed, please do. And uh, we'll be talking to everybody real soon uh, as we get started on the uh, Corvette for the uh, Cancer Awareness Group build. Okay, thanks guys. See you later.